wearing perfume. I want you guys to understand that perfume is an aroma. Welcome back to one of the best YouTube channels on the planet. It is me or me in Washington. And I have a prophetic word, you guys, that Father God has put on my heart. The most High God has put on my heart, my soul. It has for a couple of months now, to be honest with you. Stop wearing perfume. I believe that I have purchased, and I'm not sure when. I feel like I know kind of like the month I did it, if you will, or where I purchased it from. I purchased it from like this department store. And it just seemed like every single time I'm about to leave the house and I want to go spray perfume on me, God is like, don't spray that. And I have like a collection, you know, we go to Bath and Body Works, you know, we go to these stores and different things and we get all these perfumes. And it just seemed like for the past couple of months, whenever I attempt to go and spray perfume on me, God is like, don't spray that. And this, I, I realized that one of my collections, one of, one of my items in my collection is something wrong with it. Either somebody put something on it or it's a cursed object and I'm just not understanding what it is. But stop wearing perfume i want you guys to understand that perfume is an aroma you know aromas attract and if you're attracting bad spirits if you're attracting unclean spirits you have a problem and i don't know who this is for but father god told me to tell you second corinthians 2 verse 11 it says so that satan will not outsmart us for we are familiar with his evil schemes there is something going on with this with the aroma is something going on with the perfume was something in your collection is unclean and i'm not and i'm not going to I don't know specifically what kind. I don't know what brand. I don't know if it's a perfume or cologne. But Father God, whenever I leave the house and I, I go to my closet to get a perfume to put on, he's like, don't wear that. And I end up wearing Febreze. I'm being honest. I end up wearing Febreze. So I, Father God put it on my heart. The most I got put it on my heart to tell you to stop wearing your perfume. You're attracting. The aroma of it is attracting something that's unclean. The aroma is attracting something that's not holy. It's not righteous. And it's, it's wicked. So I encourage you guys to be to just listen. Walk in your, in your area. Walk into your accessory section or your perfume, your soaps. And ask the most I got what's in here that shouldn't be. There's a lot of companies that do witchcraft and sorcery within their recipes it's a lot of companies that have been exposed for certain they call it their ancestral traditions or whatever but they come up with all these witch like potions and different things like that and sell it look at their commercials pay attention to the owners and the founders and you're putting this stuff on your body thinking it's just a, a soap or a cologne and then you real life go look at their commercials and see who created this stuff and you see it's a demonic undertone anything with a demonic undertone i don't want I wish you guys nothing but the best, peace, and positive vibes. Bye.